found it. I've been looking for like a year for this specific bottle of wine and I finally, finally, finally found it. Are you ready? Are you ready? It's the Three Buck Chuck Savion Blanc. Stay tuned. Hey everybody, this is Stuart with Wine on the Dime. Before I begin the review, if you liked today's video, please remember to subscribe, like, comment, and if you really want to be awesome, hit that notification bell so you get notified every time I create a new video. So, today I'm going to be reviewing the Trader Joe's 2017 Sauvignon Blanc from California. It's from Bronco Wine Company, 12.5% alcohol by volume, and I paid $3 for it at my local Trader Joe's. Like I said, I'm very excited about this. I'm very excited about this because this is the only three buck chuck slash two buck chuck, depending on which one you get, at Trader Joe's that I have not been able to try. All of them are in stock almost all the time. They never have the Sauvignon Blanc. I was able to get one bottle. So this one bottle is all I've been able to find for a long time. I'm very excited to try it. I have no clue whether or not it's gonna be good, but I'm gonna do it anyway. Let's begin. So. From a color standpoint, and there's no screw top. It was a cork, which I'm a little disappointing. But from a color standpoint, pale lemon. Pale lemon, no artifacts, no cloudiness. Uh, from a nose, so you are going to be a, well, you're gonna be a very California. Sell me on block. You're gonna have probably, a, I'm just saying it now, just based off the nose, I'm getting a touch of lemon a lot of apple, maybe hint of pear, apricot, and a tiny bit of plastic. I, I really do, feel like like this feels very California Sauvignon Blanc. If that's even really a term. Yeah, there's really no aging. I, I didn't really expect any aging at all with this wine. Uh, and another thing, I've been sniffing a few times, I feel like I'm getting a touch of banana, which really, like, I'm really wondering, based upon especially the color of this bottle, compared to what I normally get out of Sauvignon Blanc, um, did they put Chardonnay in instead? Well, I guess the really only way to tell is to taste it now, isn't it? It's not Chardonnay. Not quite sure exactly what it is. This is a wine that is its own thing. <laughs> Very heavy body, compared to most Sauvignon Blanc. All right. Medium plus body. Medium on the acid, off dry. Really not much complexity in the flavor, mostly getting um, a mix of green and red apple. Um, maybe a touch of that lemon that I mentioned, but short finish. Doesn't even really remind me of any Sauvignon Blanc I've ever had. Even like a Foom Blanc from California. Never, never really had anything like this. Um, so, 2017 Trader Joe's Bronco Wine Company. I'm gonna give you a bad. Like, there are some $7 bottles of Sauvignon Blanc. I feel like if I drink two and a half of you, I still would be disappointed comparing to one drink, drinking one bottle of like something like Cupcake Sauvignon Blanc. I, I can't recommend you. I don't like it. If I didn't have a ton of dishes in my sink right now that I'm supposed to be cleaning because my wife is asleep and I told her I would, then I would probably pour you down the drain. So y'all won't get to see that this time. Maybe I'll clean my drain next time. But I, I, I'm extremely disappointed by this. <laughs> I was really hoping for something that would be better and um, at least acceptable. Like I would have been happy with okay. And I can't even give it that. It's just, it's just not good. Anyway, this has been Stuart with Wine on the Dime. If you liked today's video, please like, subscribe, and comment. Have you had the 2017 Trader Joe's Sauvignon Blanc? I'd be interested to know if you have. Leave a comment below, and I'll see you all again soon with another episode from Wine on the Dime.